Imagine waking up to news that a black hole is on a collision course with Earth. What would happen? A question that is as unsettling as it is fascinating. This isn't some far-fetched science fiction plot, but a possibility that scientists across the globe are examining and discussing. Imagine the sheer magnitude of an event where a black hole, an object so dense that not even light can escape its gravitational pull, comes barreling towards our home planet. What would the repercussions be? Would we have any warning? Could we survive or would it be the end of life as we know it? These are the questions that swirl around the enigma of black holes, a celestial phenomenon that continues to captivate and confound us. We have a lot to explore and understand about these mysterious entities in our universe. To answer this question, we first need to understand what a black hole really is. So, let's dive into the abyss and unravel the mysteries of black holes. Black holes, the mysterious entities of the cosmos, have fascinated and puzzled scientists for years. These celestial objects are regions of space where gravity pulls so much that even light cannot get out. The gravity is so strong because matter has been squeezed into a tiny space. This can happen when a star is dying. Now, let's break down the formation of black holes. It all begins with a star, much like our own sun but much larger. When these mammoth stars run out of nuclear fuel, they collapse under their own weight, triggering a supernova explosion. This can cause the core to compress into an area infinitely dense, known as a singularity, giving birth to a black hole. Black holes are characterized by their intense gravity, which is so powerful that it warps the fabric of space and time around it. They are invisible to the naked eye because no light can escape their gravitational pull. However, scientists can still detect them through the effect they have on nearby objects or through the X-rays emitted by the matter they are consuming. Among these elusive entities, there are those known as supermassive black holes. These behemoths reside at the center of galaxies, including our own Milky Way, and can have masses millions or even billions of times that of our Sun. Recent discoveries, like the rogue black hole detected by the Hubble Space Telescope, have added another layer to the enigma. This supermassive black hole, ejected from its own galaxy, is believed to be leaving a trail of newborn stars in its wake. Moreover, black holes can also go rogue, as one was recently discovered, moving away from its home galaxy at a speed of about 1,600 km per second for the past 39 million years. These rogue black holes are often the result of a collision between galaxies. But, in a twist, the rogue black hole discovered by Hubble seems to have been ejected due to the influence of a third galaxy and a third black hole. Black holes are not just cosmic vacuum cleaners swallowing everything in their path. They also exhibit peculiar behaviors. For instance, they mysteriously burp up fragments of stars they destroyed years earlier, a phenomenon that has left scientists scratching their heads. This suggests that our understanding of how black holes consume stars needs to be re-evaluated. Now that we understand what black holes are, let's delve into their destructive power. Black holes are not just fascinating, they are also incredibly destructive. These celestial phenomena are not only intriguing, but they're also like cosmic wrecking balls, causing chaos wherever they go. Their destructive power is beyond our wildest imagination, impacting everything in their vicinity and beyond. Let's begin with their gravitational pull. See, black holes have such a strong gravitational force that nothing, not even light, can escape from their grip. This means that anything that ventures too close to a black hole, be it a spaceship or a star, can get sucked in and cease to exist as we know it. The gravitational pull is so intense that it bends space and time, a concept that Einstein referred to as space-time curvature. Now imagine a star orbiting a black hole. As it gets closer and closer, the black hole's immense gravity starts to pull on the star. But here's the interesting part. The side of the star closer to the black hole feels a stronger pull than the far side, causing the star to stretch and deform. This is known as tidal force. And then comes the grand spectacle, a tidal disruption event, or TDE for short. A TDE occurs when a star gets too close to a black hole and is ripped apart by its extreme gravitational forces. This isn't a quick, painless process. The star is violently torn apart, its matter spiraling into the black hole and forming a bright accretion disk around it. 
But the destruction doesn't end there. Some of the star's matter doesn't make it into the black hole and instead is ejected out into space in powerful jets. And these jets are not just a simple burp from a satisfied black hole, they are high-speed streams of particles, carrying away a fraction of the star's mass at nearly the speed of light. Interestingly, recent studies have found that black holes can release matter years after destroying a star, an occurrence that has left scientists puzzled. This means that the destructive power of black holes extends over a long period, continuing to impact the surrounding space long after the initial event has taken place. So in essence, black holes are not just passive observers in the cosmos, they are active participants, shaping and influencing their environment, often in violent and destructive ways. So what would happen if such a destructive force were to hit Earth? A black hole hitting Earth is a terrifying thought, but what would it really look like? Let's delve into the mind-boggling world of astrophysics and imagine the unthinkable, a black hole colliding with our home planet. The first thing to understand is that a black hole isn't like a physical object or a meteor that would crash into the Earth. Instead, it's a region of space with a gravitational pull so strong that nothing, not even light, can escape it. As it approaches, the most noticeable effect would be the gravitational distortion. Black holes warp space and time around them. This means that as a black hole neared, we would see the stars around it start to move and distort. This effect, known as gravitational lensing, would create a mesmerizing yet terrifying spectacle in our night sky. The next effect we would experience is the tidal forces. These are the forces that cause the tides on Earth due to the gravitational pull of the Moon. Now imagine these forces amplified by a factor of a million or even a billion. The tidal forces of a black hole would be so extreme that they would stretch and squeeze Earth causing what astrophysicists call spaghettification. This would cause immense earthquakes and volcanic eruptions, far beyond anything humanity has ever experienced. As the black hole continues its relentless approach, Earth would eventually reach what is known as the event horizon, the point of no return. Once we cross this threshold, there would be no escape from the black hole's gravitational pull. Scientists speculate that time and space as we know it would cease to exist. One moment, we would be here on Earth and the next we would be inside the black hole. The Earth would be swallowed whole, disappearing from the universe as we know it. Yet, inside the black hole, things get even stranger. The laws of physics as we understand them break down. Space and time become intertwined and distorted beyond comprehension. What happens inside a black hole is one of the greatest mysteries of our universe. A black hole collision would be catastrophic to say the least, but is it something we should worry about? As we'll discuss in the next scene, while the thought is indeed terrifying, the likelihood of such an event is astronomically low. So, for now, we can continue to observe these fascinating cosmic phenomena from the safety of our home planet. The idea of a black hole hitting Earth is undoubtedly alarming, but should we be losing sleep over it? Let's delve into the scientific consensus on this topic. While black holes are mysterious and powerful entities, the chances of one directly impacting Earth are astronomically low. It's akin to the odds of a dart thrown randomly from a spaceship in outer space, landing on a specific one-inch target on Earth. Our universe is vast, and even within our Milky Way galaxy, black holes are relatively sparse. The nearest known black hole to Earth is over a thousand light years away. To put that into perspective, one light year is about 6 trillion miles. That's a considerable cosmic distance, and any movement of black holes towards us, even at the speed of light, would take thousands of years. Moreover, space agencies and astronomers worldwide are constantly monitoring the cosmos. Tools like the Hubble Space Telescope and the Zwicky Transient Facility are continually scanning the skies, helping us detect celestial bodies, including black holes, far in advance. And while there's still much we don't know about black holes, our understanding is continually improving thanks to ongoing research and scientific advancements. Now, what about safety measures? Well, if a black hole were to somehow head directly towards us, there's not much we could do to stop it. Black holes are not something we can fight or deflect. The best defense we have is knowledge and early detection, which would allow humanity to prepare and perhaps find ways to survive, such as colonizing other planets. However, 
it's essential to remember that this is all highly speculative and based on extremely low probabilities. The reality is, there are many more immediate threats to our planet, like climate change and nuclear warfare, that deserve our urgent attention. While a black hole collision is a terrifying thought, it's not something we need to worry about in our daily lives. Today, we've journeyed into the world of black holes and explored a rather unsettling question. We've dissected the enigma of black holes, these celestial objects with gravitational pulls so strong that nothing, not even light, can escape their grasp. We've learned how they form from collapsed stars, creating a point in space where the rules of physics as we know them cease to apply. We've delved into the destructive power of black holes, how they can consume stars and spew out matter years later, a phenomenon known as a tidal disruption event. We've taken a closer look at how they can eject supermassive jets of energy, capable of creating new stars in their wake. We then painted a scenario, a hypothetical situation where a black hole could impact our dear Earth. We imagined the unimaginable, the obliteration of our planet, the eradication of all life as we know it. We pondered the aftermath, the cosmic debris that would be all that's left of our home. But then, we found solace in the reality check. We learned that black holes, while destructive and terrifying, are also fascinating objects of study. We discovered that rogue black holes approaching Earth are unlikely, as their effects would have been observed if they were nearby. We understood that the chances of a black hole consuming Earth are extremely low, almost negligible, and that for now, we are safe. While black holes continue to baffle and astound us with their mysterious ways, they also serve as reminders of the vast, unexplored cosmos that lies beyond our reach. They are reminders of our place in the universe, our insignificance in the grand scheme of things, and yet, our unique ability to understand and appreciate the wonders it holds. While black holes remain a fascinating mystery, for now, we can rest easy knowing Earth is safe from their destructive reach.